हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज रोहित त्रिपाठी एंड यू आर वाचिंग मेड इजी टॉपर स्टॉक सो राइट नाउ विथ मी वी हैव अ वेरी ब्रिलियंट कैंडिडेट एंड हर नेम इज दीपा एल एस एंड शी हैज गॉट वेरी गुड रैंक रैंक 11 इन द ई एस सी टू फ्रॉम द इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग बैकग्राउंड ओके लेट मी गिव हर ब्रीफ इंट्रोडक्शन राइट नाउ सी इज वर्किंग इन सी पी डब्ल्यू डी एज जूनियर इंजीनियर and uh, uh, she joined G- this job in 2018 so she has work experience of uh, approximately 5 years she is from kerala and she did btech from government engineering college tiruvananthapuram am i right deepa yes sir okay and uh, she she has got a very good rank in gate also in gate 2023 uh, she got a rank of 348 so it's a very good rank and uh, she is a uh, uh, second ranker in her university level uh, in graduation okay so deepa congratulations to you thank you sir so uh, can you discuss your journey with us so what struggles you have faced and uh, how you have uh, overcome the hurdles uh, that you have seen Uh, while uh, uh, during the preparation time and uh, what motivates you uh, sir uh, as uh, as i already told i uh, joined my job in 2018 so after that uh, uh, i was almost fully uh, immersed in my job so but uh, during this period i had a chance to work under many ies officers i had a chance to work with around four to five ies officers so uh, all those people has uh, motivated me uh, to pursue ies as my career so then uh, i started uh, preparations uh, around 2022 so uh, I, uh, i actually uh, uh, technical subjects i prepared along with gate so after mm-hmm. uh, i qualified prelims then i gave a serious preparation for the written examination so the my main strategy was uh, i solved uh, previous year question booklets i solved almost all question that i got so, uh, okay, so that so tell us about main thing okay yes Deepa, uh, tell us uh, how many uh, years pyq you have solved uh, sir uh, whatever was in that uh, question booklet i have solved everything sir okay very yeah. good so uh, that is commendable effort and yes. other than uh, pyq okay yes. any other courses that you have followed uh, sir uh, my main issue was my time because uh, i was actually working so my job was actually from 9:30 to 6 and uh, sometimes it will go beyond that also so mm-hmm. my evening time was actually very limited to me so uh, i usually i study in the morning time i used to get up around 5 o'clock and uh, completely i used to study till 9 o'clock so not even one day i uh, missed it uh, for around one year so uh, <laughs> that work i have done so uh, so but this time i i have uh, devoted completely for studies uh, for uh, engineering engineering services as well as gate also so this one year so like this i managed my time and uh, around the last time uh, for uh, means uh, just i was about to give the mains examinations in june at that time instead of the booklets uh, i used to um, uh, uh, take the print out of the question paper without answers in it so okay. means it won't be topic wise yeah. so i used those yeah. uh, previous year questions question booklets itself yeah. and uh, then i used to with, with respect to year like uh, 2018 19 20 21 okay, like I that i understood but uh, right. one question i am going to ask from you okay okay sir and the question is very simple uh, yeah. since you have taken print out of uh, previous year questions okay yes sir and uh, that will that will contain all the subjects yes okay sir. and uh, in the uh, paper 1 and paper 2 there is a time limit of 3 hours for both yes, of sir. the papers okay yes. so suppose you are solving any pyq like uh, uh, 2018 esc paper 1 electrical okay 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 suppose you are solving you were solving yes, at that time so okay. uh, have you done any um, 
uh, setting up alarm also so that uh, it will remind you that uh, only three hours I have to in the duration of three hours I have to solve this paper. No, so, sir. Have you done that at that time? No, uh, I at that time I did not do it. I actually did that only for one paper. But uh, what okay. I did was that even if I took the time, uh, hmm. I actually uh, I did not attempt it like. Uh, only six questions I have to answer out of eight. Mm -hmm. I answered mm -hmm. all the eight questions because my idea okay. was uh, my, all the questions uh, answers I should be able to give in whatever way they ask. So okay, like I that, right, right. Okay, so those who yaha par Deepa se baat karke, hume aisa laga ki kabi kabi life utni stressful nahi honi chahiye. Sometimes ap jada stress le lete hain, to apka performance वीक uh, हो जाता है आप उतना अच्छा परफॉर्म नहीं कर पाते हैं तो दीपा से हमें ये भी सीखने को मिला कि कभी कभी uh, जो आपका कंफर्टेबल जोन है वो आपका स्ट्रॉन्गेस्ट पॉइंट हो सकता है समटाइम्स इफ यू आर कंफर्टेबल देन यू कैन परफॉर्म वेल तो जैसे दीपा ने बताया कि कोई पेपर वो पी वाई क्यू का उठाती थी और पेपर वन या पेपर टू के uh, जो रूल्स हैं लाइक आउट ऑफ एट फाइव क्वेश्चन सॉल्व करने होते हैं बट ये आउट ऑफ एट कभी कभी एट क्वेश्चन भी सॉल्व कर लेते थे कभी कभी सेवन क्वेश्चन भी सॉल्व कर लेते थे बट दीपा वन क्वेश्चन आई हैव टू आस्क दैट सपोज इफ यू आर सॉल्विंग एनी रेस्पेक्टिव पेपर लाइक पेपर वन और पेपर टू ओके एंड इट्स नॉट पॉसिबल ऑलवेज दैट वी नो ऑल दी एट क्वेश्चन आंसर ऑफ एट क्वेश्चन ओके सो इन दैट क्वेश्चन सपोज you are able to solve only six questions or four questions then what uh, you will do about rest of three questions you don't know uh, sir at that time uh, uh, practice i uh, close it there but after that i will get the answers of the questions i don't know actually that will help us a lot uh, during the preparations so only like that we will be able to learn more because obviously there will be questions that we don't know uh, but after that if we leave it like that uh, we won't get anything out of it so after closing it uh, we have to think some time maybe after thinking some time we will automatically get the answer otherwise we have to refer again some books and uh, we have to find out the answer so that finding okay. out the answer is more important now again there is one more question that i will ask from uh, your answer that uh, okay. suppose uh, the question that uh, you were unable to solve okay yes, and uh, you don't know the answer okay yeah. and still uh, it is very important because uh, this type of questions or uh, the question uh, that have been asked from uh, the topic that is yeah. frequently been asked in the esc pyq okay okay so do you have sources uh, for those questions also like uh, suppose question is from uh, signal line system let us take okay. example of signal line system okay yes, so what sources do you have because you don't know the answer but you want to know the answer so uh, in that sir, case, it is, what you have done yes sir uh, sir if it is actually from pyq means uh, we obviously first option is our booklet uh, now hmm. if Uh, that option is not available means second option is the faculty that we uh, who taught us so all faculties were very cooperative and they gave us even the phone number to discuss the questions okay, okay. any doubts and even uh, within 5 minutes itself i got the reply of uh, all the queries i asked so uh, it was extremely so support that is very good thing okay yes. so that is very good thing yes so dosto yahan se hame ye bhi pata chalta hai ki preparation ki journey mein जो फैकल्टीज uh, होते हैं जो टीचर्स होते हैं उनका साथ भी बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट है समटाइम्स yes. आपको किसी क्वेश्चन का आंसर नहीं आ रहा है या किसी टॉपिक में आप कंफर्टेबल फील नहीं कर रहे हैं तो वहां पर जो हमारे टीचर्स होते हैं वो हमें गाइड कर सकते हैं कि हमें सोर्सेज क्या फॉलो करने चाहिए और एग्जैक्टली exactly यही दीपा ने किया अच्छा अब इसके बाद दीपा ने हमें ये भी बताया कि उन्होंने इंटरव्यू गाइडेंस प्रोग्राम मेड जी का टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री का भी ज्वाइन किया था ओके सो दीपा वट वॉज योर एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ इंटरव्यू गाइडेंस प्रोग्राम कैन यू शेयर यस सर ऑब्वियसली सो वेन आई एक्चुअली गॉट सिलेक्टेड फॉर यू सी मेन्स 
so this large scale interview it was my first experience so i was re- literally tensed up when i passed mains i was happy but at the same time i was uh, really tensed so uh, and also it was uh, it was going to be a very big panel like four to five members that also very distinct huge members so at that time uh, uh, this interview guidance program was announced so i joined and at that time uh, i joined as an online program so at that time itself i saw like many students uh, similar to my condition i uh, saw so uh, at that time my tension level actually began to reduced uh, and uh, okay, then cool. i had a wonderful I, experience i can understand because <laughs> okay. you have uh, gone through the uh, mock interviews also and uh, yes, and sometimes you have not prepared for the interview and you have appeared in the mock interview so uh, yes, in that situation you might be tensed Okay. Yes. Sir. And is there any question uh, that have been asked in the actual ESC interview uh, that was very similar to the question that have been asked in the mock interview? Any question? Uh, sir, actually, um, the experience was what guided me. The questions mm-hmm. like very similar. It was not asked. Actually, the questions asked for me at the interview was very simpler than. Uh, i had at the uh, bdc okay. but it, it prepared me to that level so okay. it was a very wonderful experience actually even okay. uh, the dress code everything because usually for boys only they say this dress code suits and also for girls uh, rarely they specify but uh, ruba madam from bdc madam actually replied to uh, me by whatsapp and uh, madam told mm-hmm. like this is good this is good and also that also okay. gave me a lot of confidence so mm-hmm. तो दोस्तों यहाँ से ये भी पता चलता है कि जो मेडीजी का इंटरव्यू गाइडेंस प्रोग्राम है इसका जो लेवल है दैट इज डिफिकल्ट और दैट इज वेरी सिमिलर टू एक्चुअल यूपीएससी इंटरव्यू इनफैक्ट यहाँ जो इंटरव्यू का स्ट्रेस होता है इसका लेवल आई थिंक और इसका जो डिफिकल्टी का लेवल है वो एक्चुअल यूपीएससी के इंटरव्यू से ज्यादा है और यहाँ भी आपको काफी हेल्प मिलती है लाइक वट शुड बी योर ड्रेसिंग कोड एंड आपको अपने पर्सनैलिटी में क्या चेंजेस करने चाहिए सो uh, दैट so कि आपका एक्चुअल ईएससी का इंटरव्यू अच्छा जाए ओके सो एंड अदर देन दिस हैव यू गिवन टेस्ट सीरीज बाय मेड इजी और एनी टेस्ट सीरीज Uh, so actually i have given one test series but uh, it was not related to esc i have uh, given one uh, cgpdtm uh, patent examination okay. level 10 boost uh, okay. but other than that i have not given any other test series my okay. time was actually very limited okay and uh, yes. uh, yahan deepa se baat karke hame ye bhi pata chala ki agar kuch banna hai to effort to karna hi padega लाइक like, yes. ये सीपीडब्ल्यूडी में वर्किंग रहे और uh, 2022 से इन्होंने ईएससी का प्रिपरेशन स्टार्ट किया और इस जर्नी में 2022 से 23 तक का अगर हम लोग देखें तो जो इनका वर्किंग शेड्यूल है जो कि काफी हेक्टिक रहता है वहां से एवरीडे टाइम निकाल करके ईएससी के लिए पढ़ना प्री के लिए प्रिपेयर करना मेंस के लिए प्रिपेयर करना और उसके बाद अच्छा परफॉर्म करना इट इज लाइक क्लाइंबिंग to the everest am i right geeta yes sir yes sir am i right deepa yes sir okay to so deepa aapse baat karke bahut acha laga and uh, once again congratulations to you thank and, you uh, uh, in your journey yes sir any person who has helped you uh, more and uh, who who has motivated you from your family for, from your parents you want to take any name then uh, this is the platform uh, sir uh, i would say uh, like uh, 80 percentage of my efforts uh, were up from my family my family supported me to a great extent because uh, i know uh, uh, because uh, i was actually working so working studying working studying was my pattern so but uh, they did not uh, let me know any other tension from any other factor so they mm-hmm. they were like a solid ground of support to me so uh, they were the most uh, brilliant people who supported me and also from my department also i had uh, many people who supported me like anything once they came to know that i was preparing for this uh all of my even my uh, ae and uh, my sir also both of them 
also supported me to the very end till the end my results were declared because i was actually talking with my ae sir when uh, my i got the notification that results were declared on my so sir was the person who checked my results so it was to that level so yeah. okay to so, dosto yeah. yahan agar hum log deepa se humne jo baat kiya usse hame ye bhi pata chala ki parivar se badh ke kuch nahi hai aur jo parivar ka सपोर्ट होता है वो मोर देन एनी थिंग इन दिस वर्ल्ड ओके सर वन मोर थिंग आई विश टू से यस 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 यू कैन से सर एक्चुअली आई एम मैरिड एंड माय हस्बैंड वाज द प्राइमरी पर्सन हु पुश्ड मी इनटू रिपीटिंग दिस अटेम्प्ट फॉर एएससी after 2017 okay. i attempted to only in 2023 and the primary person who was responsible for that was actually my husband okay. so he also supported so, as a uh, family person yes uh, deepa ke bare mein agar hum log dekhe to inke husband ne sabse zyada support kiya fir inki family mein inke parents ne aur inke department ne bhi kafi support kiya बट मोर देन दिस दीपा का डेडिकेशन काफी अच्छा रहा और स्ट्रगल को फेस कैसे करना है हर्डल्स को ओवरकम कैसे करना है ये सारी चीजें दीपा को आती हैं और जो सबसे अच्छी बात लगी कि कभी कभी आप अपने कंफर्टेबल जोन में रहें तो वो आपका स्ट्रॉन्गेस्ट पॉइंट हो सकता है ये हमें दीपा से सीखने को मिला है सो वंस अगेन कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन दीपा एंड सो This is all for today. तो okay, दर्शकों को आपको काफी अच्छा और काफी कुछ सीखने को मिला होगा दीपा से तो इसी तरह नए कैंडिडेट की जर्नी नेक्स्ट एपिसोड में होगी और नेक्स्ट वीडियो में होगी ओके थैंक यू एवरी वन थैंक यू सर